Hi, and welcome to Match Right. We appreciate your business. And I'm here to show you how to get the most out of your eye view. Let's talk about what's in the box. The first thing you'll have is your Match Right eye view. You'll also be given power cables, along with a USB cable that'll connect to the computer. You'll have accessories like our chip clip, our sample holder. You'll be given a cleaning kit, an information packet and registration cards, along with a black mat that's utilized for color measurement to give us a neutral background. There will be a user manual CD which will come in multiple languages and there's also utilities on there for troubleshooting. Now that we have everything out of the box, let's connect the instrument to the computer. First thing we want to do is connect the power to the instrument. We want to have the instrument power up for at least 30 minutes. That warms the instrument up and makes it so it is acclimated to the conditions in your paint store. While that's powered up, let's look through some of the accessories and get those in place for proper color measurement. We talked about the black mat. It's self-adhesive. What we want to do is we want to peel that and then place it on our paint counter in a position that we're going to do a lot of color measurement. One of the things we don't want is light reflecting off of your countertop while you're doing a measurement. So the black mat gives us an area that we can now have a consistent background for color measurement. Two of the other accessories, the sample holder and the chip clip, will allow us proper sampling for when we do custom matches. Now that the instrument's warmed up for that half hour's time, what we want to do is we want to plug in the USB cable to the back of the computer and the instrument. In the Found New Hardware, we first want to click on the No, Not at This Time. We click on the next button. We then are going to load the driver for the iView. We click next. Once that's done, you have now loaded the driver to connect to the software. Now that we've established a connection with the instrument, let's go and connect it to our software. Although the iView can connect to many softwares, we're going to focus on the color designer. What we simply need to do is click on the icon, color designer. Once we're in the software, we're going to go to housekeeping. We click on the housekeeping button. We're going to open up the housekeeping with the password 1234. Hit the enter button. We'll then go to setup, to instruments, and we're going to then select the iView instrument at the bottom of our instrument types. The next step we'll do is we'll go through calibration. Calibration is important and it's only done once a week. What it does is it ensures consistent color matching. Proper technique is we simply slide the calibration plaque to the forward position. Once that's in place we simply click on the measure button and it'll go through a series of measurement of the white calibration plaque. Once the white calibration is done, the next step is to slide the calibration plaque back into its lock position, place the instrument down on the black mat, click on measure. It'll take one measurement. Once that's done, the instrument is now calibrated. Now let's do some color matching. The iView has many features and functions that will help us get the best color match possible. But to do that, we may use some of our accessories that came with the instrument. The instrument has the capability of measuring a 12 millimeter or a 6 millimeter sample. But what we want to do is we want to ensure that the sampling is done in the proper way. With the sample holder, we simply slide that on the bottom rail of the instrument. We can now simply slide a sample underneath there. Our active visual targeting allows us to see exactly where we're going to measure. Once we know where we're going to measure, we can now go to the software and do a custom match. Another technique in color measurement might be the small sample. What we have is an accessory called the chip clip. And this allows us to measure very small samples. But in order to do it properly, we need to place the instrument on its back. Once the instrument's on its back, it automatically enables the small aperture setting for measurement. What we can do now is we can take our sample, place it inside the chip clip, slide it on the rail, and then go to the software 
and in a custom match. The iView has many features and benefits that can help you in color matching. You may have customers that bring in paint sticks. The technology now allows us to simply place a sample right underneath the instrument. I can simply line that sample up, measure, and go. Customers will bring in inspiration items. They may bring in a <clears throat> coffee cup that they want that color off of. Because I have the line of sight, I'm able to measure the sample. I'll also do a sheen identification so that I can get the right sheen to match the right color. What about a sample like a pillow or it may be a towel from the bathroom? Because I've got the aperture capability to switch between large and small, almost any sample can be brought in and measured. Thank you for your time. We are confident that the Match Right Eye View is going to be the solution for all your color matching.